Hey guys. Thank you. I have a personal love story. I thought it's a little bit early for this story, but don't worry. The story comes from Europe. The nightlife just begun in Europe. So today, I'm presenting Munich. So first of all, I would like to ask you a question. Are you the type who falls in and out of love very fast and hard? Or are you someone who is looking for a long-lasting relationship? This is a question I had to ask myself recently. It's not in relation to love, but to the city I lived in. Do I want to live in a city that feels like a short affair? Or am I ready to commit to one place? So, this is my story. I, I came from China to Germany for college. And Munich was calling me all the time. Although I, I had never been there before. You would call it fate. But for me, I came here for my PhD. We matched right away. It was, it was the world-class university that attracted me and the chance to work with some of the brightest minds and all that for free. So from the start, my relationship with, with, with Munich matched and financially. So, and this is my story. And I was not sure what I was looking for next as a young guy. But I knew I could rely on Munich to offer me many opportunities. Would I work for a big a corporation like BMW or a tech giant like Apple? Or would I build my own company to follow the footsteps of many uni Munich unicorns? But I started my career at Siemens. I thought Yemen, someone from, from Siemens maybe, Siemens is one of the biggest companies in the world. And the knowledge and the skill I got there were instrumental when I built up my company, Liangdao, in Munich. And I have already raised more than 50 million euros for my startup. Yeah, it sounds magic. Why Munich? Because in Munich, you can try out different versions of yourself. The city is always be there, by your side, cheering you on. And you will meet in Munich people who want to build a better and more sustainable world, who are all about cooperating and coming up with new ideas together. And Munich is the city which makes you to drive to become your best self. Look. The talents there are building flying taxis. What? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> but not finished. <laughs> so, when I come to Munich, it was love at first sight. It's something you notice very quickly because it's beautiful. Munich is built as stage for monarchy, and today, it makes everyone feel like queens and kings. Munich is very safe, but not boring. We have lots of little surprises, like Esbachwelle, a wave in the, little, in the little river where people can surf direct in the city center. And people here are like trying new things. Someone even put a decommissioned ship on top of a railway station and turn it into a cool bar. But of course, as a very good German academic, I will never claim something was cool without a reputable source. <laughs> I heard it's a perfect place for date. But you know, these days, my favorite date is cooking barbecue for my family and teammates. So speaking of good dates, I can't come here to talk about Munich without talk about Oktoberfest. It's special, it's tradition, it's our date with the city. There's a reason why everyone travels. <laughs> Thank you for laughing. This is a reason. 
<laughs> I think you get the reason. The reason is we can get the energy direct from Munich's soul. It's beer, I know, but it's more culture there. <laughs> so, falling in love with Munich. Oh, sorry. I have to go one step back. So, but let's be real. Every relationship faces struggle. What happened if you feel stuck? And then Munich becomes your home base to explore Europe. If you miss one stop on your train, then suddenly you are in Austria, <laughs> in Switzerland, in Czech Republic, and in Italy. And that's all on your doorstep. Even Berlin is four hours away if you ever need to go there. But today, Berlin is here. It's not so far away. It's OK. So falling in love with Munich is like falling in love with a perfect partner. At the first glance, what does matter? It looks good. And you will, you will notice the brain, and you have lots of fun. But at the end, what makes you stick together, what makes you commit, is a character. And Munich is a city with character. It makes its people better, and its people make the city for the better one. And this is what made me say yes when I applied for the German citizenship. It made me think about me and Munich, about our relationship. Can I see myself living there my whole life? Am I there for the right place? My answer was clear. Yes, I am. So I put a ring, or better, a passport on it. Thank you. <laughs> so, this is my love story with Munich. I'm building my life there, my startup, my family, and my legacy. And this is my love story for all of you. And what is your story? Let me know. Thank you very much. Oh, so great. <laughs> Put a passport on it. That might be my favorite thing. <laughs> Way to go. All right, quick questions for our friends from Munich. Please. Yeah. What is your business? My business is software business. I'm doing um, software for autonomous driving, which is very, uh, we have a very good environment in Munich with BMW and other autonom autonom companies. Great. Yeah, Great please. question. Yeah, yeah. Oh, sorry. Uh, what's the difference between uh, Bavar Bavaria and Munich? I think we have friends here. I will say Munich is the heart of Bavaria. Oh, yes. <coughs> Part of the love story. <laughs> well done. Yeah, I yes, think you have a question too. And where did your technology come from? The technology we, we, we built it in Munich. It's made in Germany. Yeah. Thank you. Okay. Last question. What was it that was really enabling about where you built your business that you couldn't have done anywhere else? Um, I think we are a startup building unique technology in, in sensor technology. So in Germany, we have the chance to build this kind of component, which is uh, not easy in uh, somewhere else. And you know, in Germany, there, in Munich, there are lots of good talents who can go from BMW and all this environment. So it's very important to have a right place to start your business. And this is my success story, yes. Awesome, let's go fall in love in Munich. Well done, thank you so much.